Hi everybody, today is November 26, 2013. Security breach confirmed in state-run healthcare exchange. Amid concerns that the Obama exchange website healthcare.gov may have already been compromised, it has been confirmed that the state-run website in Vermont experienced a security breach in October. The Burlington Free Press reported on Friday that officials overseeing the website confirmed there has been a breach on the system last month in which one user got improper access to another user's social security number and other data. An unidentified consumer reported that an unnamed sender mailed him a copy of his own application for insurance under the state exchange, the Free Press reported. Vermont Health Connect is not a secure website was written on the back of the envelope and was also written on the back of the last page of the printed out application, said the incident report. Vermont Health Access Commissioner Mark Larson said the incident was the only one of its kind since the website launched October 1st, adding that technical changes have been made and the breach cannot be replicated today. When asked about a security breach in a November 5th meeting of the House Health Care Committee, Larson told U.S. Representative, his department had investigated one such complaint and it had proven unfounded, the Free Press reported. Well, now we know he was lying. As for healthcare.gov website, David Kennedy, CEO of information security firm Trusted SEC, told a House Science, Space, and Technology Committee the hackers are definitely after it, Fox News reported last week. And if I had to guess, based on what I can see, I would say the website is either already hacked or will be soon, Kennedy said. In my own personal opinion, I'll pay the $95 a year fine instead of $300 a month. All right, bookmark my site. I'll keep you up to date. Please stay safe, and I'll talk to you there. Good job. Bye.